So you went fishing, you caught a fish, and now you're here. The absolute easiest way I know how to clean a fish is to use an electric knife and cut on this dotted line right here. Make sure you go behind that little gill fin flappy thing. There's probably an anatomical name for that, but it escapes me at the moment. Anyway, go down, hit backbone, turn your knife, go towards the tail, stop before you go all the way through, and flip that over, go between the meat and the skin and that comes out all nice and neat and then you should hit the like button because you're here and you like it do the other side exactly the same way except upside down unless you're ambidextrous i guess and then it would be backwards anyway then what you're left with is two fillets with a little bit of rib meat so just take a pocket knife and cut right behind the ribs and no bones Okay, the batter is two parts self-rising white cornmeal and one part self-rising flour. Make extra, you'll thank me later. Now the next part's super subjective, but I like seasoning salt, black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, chili powder, and lemon pepper. Just till you can taste them in there. If you get too much in there, it's not a big deal. You can just put more flour and cornmeal. Whisk everything together until it's thoroughly combined and taste it and adjust accordingly. Now as you can see this is quite a lot of batter but that extra part is coming up and so what we're going to do here is take out about a quarter of it and that's what we're actually battering the fish with. The rest we're turning into hush puppies. Yep. That's right, because you're frying fish, you've got hot oil anyway, you might as well deep fry some cornbread, you know what I'm saying? Now you can really go crazy with hush puppies if you want to. I've got a few jalapenos here and an onion that I'm slicing up pretty finely so they mix in and are all not huge in your hush puppies. And then you just put in one egg after you crack it, of course, and then just enough milk to make it all wet, sandy kind of you know like this on your screen that's why you're watching a video look make it look like this now get your oil to 350 degrees fahrenheit that's like i don't know 180 degrees celsius somewhere in there math and uh get a metal spoon like you would eat ice cream with i don't know why i said ice cream but i did dip it in the oil so it's kind of non-stick spoon out a little bit of batter and put it in there these are going to cook super fast like less than two minutes so keep your eye on them use a spider get them out put them on paper towel let them cool off or you will destroy your mouth on these but it's worth it now let your fillets sit in some buttermilk for no longer than like four minutes and 14 seconds and then run them through your batter make sure it gets all good and coated and then fry them in similarly tempered oil to the hush puppies for about four or five minutes or until they're golden brown and looking like this and this is normally where i would say thanks for watching but on this one i'm saying you're welcome